your Storm Tracker team forecast with meteorologist Ashley Renee. Welcome back everyone. It is a cold Tuesday morning. It's 35 now in Woodville and 42 right here in Baton Rouge. So don't forget to bundle up before leaving home. Now we do still have a few clouds present and we'll still pretty much have this view for the rest of our day with mostly sunny to partly cloudy skies. Highs will be getting to the mid to upper 60s, 67 for Baton Rouge and 68 for Gonzales are the high temps for today, but we'll be staying rain free for the next couple of days. Now we'll have a weak cold front moving to the area, helping to bring in an additional round of cooler and drier air, which will help us to stay cooler as we approach the midweek and get into Thursday and high pressure in place is helping to limit our rain chances and give us this nice weather. But once high pressure moves up to the east over the next couple of days, then we'll start to have the southerly wind flow bringing in that warmer air and gulf moisture once again, which will help our temperatures and dew points to rise. So at the end of this week, Friday into Saturday, it will be warmer and a little more humid. Overnight lows will be in the upper 30s to low 40s, 41 one for Baton Rouge, 42 for Gonzales and Napoleonville, and our morning lows will still be pretty chilly for Thursday with temps in the 30s. But then once that warmer air returns, our lows will be rising just a little bit into Friday and more so for Saturday morning. Now highs for tomorrow will be in the upper 50s to about 60. So again, a cooler day as we'll still have this cooler air flowing in. Rain chances will be increasing for Friday into Sunday, 20% on Friday, mainly for Friday night, 60% for Saturday, and rain chances will be decreasing for Sunday. We have another cold front that will be moving in over the weekend. We'll still have all this warm moist air pushing in ahead of that frontal boundary. Now the front should be moving into our area on Saturday. We could possibly have some showers early Saturday, but mainly expecting it for the afternoon, Saturday night, and then continuing early overnight to Sunday morning. Now the GFS model is showing that we should be done with the rain by late Saturday night. But again, we'll just watch as we get closer and closer to the day of this event. But that next cold front is on the way and the Storm Prediction Center has parts of Louisiana under a severe, severe weather threat on Saturday. Now most of it is covering central, northern and southwest Louisiana, but we do have a little sliver of the greater Baton Rouge area also included in that severe weather threat, including Point Coupee and West Feliciana. And that's what we're seeing for now. But for today through Thursday, Cool and dry, highs in the 60s. Overnight lows will be in the upper 30s to low 40s for Wednesday morning, 30s for Thursday, warming up into the 70s for our high for Friday and Saturday. That cold front moves in, and then our highs will be near 60 for Sunday and Monday, and we'll have cooler and drier weather to start off next week. 